The renaissance of the Nigerian theatres in recent times has encouraged more and more quality productions. Today, a female liberation-themed OMG The Musical emphasizes the strength of the female regardless of societal standings and hierarchy. The story follows the lead, a vibrant young girl, Gafuma, and her quest in finding her purpose. After suffering gender discrimination, Gafuma journeys back into time as she tries to understand the historic role of women. The essence of the play to reality is how it affects, how in our society today, how we, how do I even put it, the segregation amongst women and, and men. It's not a feminist thing. In the play you discover that they also portrayed that men are also like a support system to the men, you know. So um, I, I think that's what the story is about. You, you look familiar. Are you, um, are you Gambo Sawaba? In this intriguing story, which emphasizes the role of women in the society, Gafuma meets three great Nigerian women activists on her journey to the past. Lion of Lishabi, defender of the women, first woman in everything, first woman to attend a Biokuta grammar school, and first woman to drive a car. Olufumilayo Ransom Kuti, Margaret Ekpo, and Hajia Gambo Sawaba. These three heroines fought for the freedom of women. Together, they found the key to freedom, a key which only Gafuma can decipher. I belong to the OMG. In fact, I am Lieutenant Gafuma 2IC. 2IC. But of course, 2I should see. No, Mama Gambo. I meant second in command. Aha. Oh. It was even my turn to become Supreme Commander. But I was overlooked. Why? Do you know how it is? Women cannot be Supreme Commanders. It's a guinea. The beauty of the play is in the unraveling of the name Gafuma, how the name came about, you know, and how she draws strength from the three women that we are talking about. That's Olufumilayo, Ransom Kuti, Margaret Ekbo, and Gambo Sawaba. Back to the present, Gafuma takes a stand and fights for what is right as she realizes that no one needs a leadership position to make a difference. Ah! Ah! Tell your great whatever it's not great. That, that if he does not stop his high-handedness against the women, I shall personally pay him a visit. We want to talk about African heroes, African cultures. Um, and then we started, we started with legends, bringing five heroes of Africa down on stage. And then OMG is very special because these are three Nigerian heroes that are mostly not even talked about. You know, history is something that we should teach our children, or even the parents don't know the history. I, I wonder how many people know Gambo Sawaba. And then these are people who have paid sacrifices for us to be where we are today. And then the fights of women against men and blah, blah, blah. If we actually have a history, um, we won't actually have gotten into this level. So we thought about it that the only way to change this narrative is if we engage it. And how do we engage it? We need to put something like this on stage so that people can learn. It goes beyond the entertainment, the education, and then they, they, we, we, we plan to inform and inspire people through this place. And that's the reason why we are doing OMG the Musical. OMG the Musical seeks to reawaken and promote ah. arts and culture. Ah. We'll be back for you lots. Ah. 